Hey guys, welcome to my new YouTube channel. In this video, I will be teaching you how to hide data behind images. This is my new channel, so I hope I will be able to entertain you guys with my tricks and some programs. So without wasting time, let's begin. So first we need the file that we need to hide, which we want to hide. And, the, and a picture which we can download anywhere from the internet and we also need a software called WinRAR we can download it from this website the links will be in the description so now first thing what we need to do is uh, after installing the WinRAR we just need to right click on the file that we want to hide and select add to archive and select the RAR or as or the zip and press OK. I deal with the RAR and next we gonna need to do is go to start type CMD and then go to location of the folder this folder that is desktop slash hide I had already put the files that I wanted to hide in the same folder. So now if we open this one, we will see that the file that we wanted to hide is inside it. And now we will need to type a command and that is copy backslash b name of the photo that we want to hide the doc data inside that is tech and the extension is very much important like this one has jpg yeah and now plus this one the file rar file that is uh, test dot rar and now the output file that will be we can name anything but i'm naming output the jpg for instance now we can see that one file has been copied And that is this one so now if we double click the image will open and when we right click the image and click on open with and then winrar archiver then here the file which we wanted to hide is here we can delete the rest of the items and now also this thing will work like this yeah the file which we wanted to hide is inside behind the fold photo folder photo and that's all guys hope you like the video if you have any problem regarding the video or the tutorial or if you want to ask me any questions about technology or you if you want me to provide you a video tutorial about anything feel free to ask me in the comment section thank you